Good afternoon. I'm Rob White, president and owner of Dahlstrom Roll Form, and we're out in the shop today to talk a little bit about the different types of strength, the different types of steel, and the different strengths of steel that we use for roll forming structural components here at Dahlstrom. And uh, I'm out here today to, to demonstrate the difference in different yield strength steels. And when I say yield strength, yield strength is the resistance the steel has to bending and the resistance the steel has to bending and permanently deforming under load. So if, if you know uh, a little bit about steel, you know that it's produced in different grades or different hardnesses. Well, uh, nowadays, uh, the, the uh, strength of the steels and the alloying that's used to make the steels has come a long way. The uh, auto industry, for example, has, has used much higher strength steels in the, the, the chassis and the bodies of the cars because they can make thinner shapes that have the same strength as uh, the previously only available uh, lower KSI yield steels. So what I have here today is two examples of very readily available steel. This is a standard commercial quality steel, cold rolled steel, which typically is in a strength range of about 30 KSI, or that's 30,000 pounds per square inch of force resistance against bending. And again, it's very uh, readily available. Uh, most steel service centers have this on the shelf and it's a uh, uh, relatively low cost. So what I'm gonna do is try and bend this and then I'm gonna compare it to a higher KSI steel, an 80 KSI or 80,000 uh, uh, um, PSI or pounds per square inch of resistance to force. So let's start out with the, uh, with the commercial quality steel. Okay, so there was some resistance to that. There is some strength quality in, in, uh, in uh, standard uh, 1080 or, or commercial quality steel. And that's why it's very popular for roll form shapes and for a lot of fabricated assemblies. This is the same gauge, a 14 gauge. This is in 80 KSI. So this is um, roughly three times the strength and about the same cost per pound. So let's see what this is in terms of strength. much, much tougher to bend that shape, um, which shows the difference in its, its, its ability to be used for structural shapes. And again, you know, we think certain industries like the trailer industry and the railroad industry really should start understanding the, the, uh, the quality increase of high KSI steels because we can buy them for relatively the same cost per pound. We can make shapes thinner which leads to less raw material cost on a sell price of a component. And in roll forming, uh, uh, the raw material can be 50, 60, 70% of the sell price. So that's a, that's a big advantage. So again, uh, if you'd like to know more about different strength steels and how they apply to your designs, give us a call at roll, uh, Dahlstrom Roll Form or uh, check in with us at dahlstromrollform.com. Thanks for stopping in today.